One company, three managers, seven sins. Our competitors have far more followers on social media than us. We don't have enough followers on social media. How can we get more? Why would we want more? Don't we have enough? What's the business case on that? Envy on others' fame on social media makes Chris take bad decisions. Yeah, hi, this is Sarah here. We need help with our social media strategy. Yeah, I could come by your office. Thanks. See you soon. Yeah, that sounds great. I'll see you then. Bye. So, we have the to-do list, we have doing, test and done. So. This is the way I want to work. Okay. Hmm? Good. John, come here. Look, we have 1400 more followers on Twitter this week than last week. Oh, uh, that's great. Hi, Ann. I'm Sarah. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Coffee? Yes, thank mm -hmm. you. Thank you. Hi. Hello. My name is Sarah. Chris. Nice to meet you. We got fake followers. Okay. Yeah, we want to succeed on social media, but uh, buying followers doesn't work. Right, right. No, it would make sense because mm -hmm. Buying followers would mean that you would not have real people in most cases that follow you guys because that would be data or bots and stuff like that. So uh, for, for real social media strategies to work on a consumer basis, you need to have people who are in love with your brand and shares it with their own networks. Yeah. What should we do? Well, again, I think you need to create the kind of content that your consumers really love so that they would spread the word, because that's how you would build a bigger brand from a consumer perspective. So content, that's basically it. Okay, uh, how do we do that? Well, I would start by setting some goals for your social presence. So first of all, what, what kind of achievements do we want to have from being present there? So on Facebook, how many followers and what should that lead to? You need to have goal setting, right? Mm -hmm. And secondly, you need to understand your buyers or consumers really well. You need to understand what kind of content they love. You need to understand uh, what kind of mindset they are in when they are on social channels. Because in some cases, Instagram might be perfect for you guys and your brand. And in some cases, it might be Facebook. So you need to understand that. Yeah. But this is different from how we do today. Yeah, you would approach it differently, definitely. Because at the point where you are today, you're not really getting any ROI at all. And you're not mm. getting any brand awareness at all either. So yeah, that would be a different approach. But it sounds expensive. Well, I mean, expensive in correl correlation to what? If you want to have ROI when people buy from you guys, it would be a big project, but expensive, it's all based on what you get back, right? And will you take care of that? Yes. Great. Mm. Exciting. Yes. We all want fame without any effort. The truth is that you need a lot of hard work and have some luck. We need to increase our marketing effort on social media. We have to work differently. <laughs>